Yeah, when I implant a trifocal intraocular lens, um, I obviously want to achieve a spectacle independence in my uh, patients. Therefore, I look for an optic uh, which can provide good visual acuity results in the far, intermediate and near distance. Many of my patients are quite young when they receive their intraocular lens, so I'm also looking for a very good intraocular lens material. Most of my patients, they come in and they want to be spectacle free. So it means that most of our implants are trifocal eye wells. My experiences with the Vivinex geometric platforms are quite well by now. It's a C-loop uh, eye well with a hydrophobic acrylate. It comes preloaded. You can rather push it in or screw it in. So from the implantation technique and the use of the eye well, it's very similar to all other Hoya models. So it was very easy for me to adapt and it was a very flat learning curve. Regarding the outcomes, um, I have to say that it's nice that there's two geometric eye wells on the market that, that we can play with. The two eyes differed just in the amount of energy focused at the macula and not in the ad power. The geometric provides more energy for distance and the plus version more energy for near. No other these differences like reading distances or surface features are involved, which means that the differences are subtle and not easy detectable if a patient compares eyes. The balance between the two gives a very smooth transition from far to intermediate to near. On the other hand, for uh, people who want to have more distance and intermediate, we can implant the geometric in both eyes. We have used the Vivinex geometric IOL in various clinical trials in our center. In terms of the outcomes, we found very good visual acuity results in the far, intermediate and near distance. Therefore, uh, the patients were spectacle independent and very satisfied with the results of a surgery. Photic phenomena were comparable to other uh, trifocal intraocular lenses and did not lead uh, to patient uh, dissatisfaction. Um, we also uh, looked in this uh, clinical trial for um, the development of glistenings and we could confirm that indeed the Vivinex material was completely free of glistening. This polymer promises to be clinically glistening free. After 10 months, I haven't seen any posterior capsular pacification or any glistening. And the implanted eye wells sit perfectly into the capsular bag with no rotation or axis shift for the toric ones. The clinical outcomes of my patients with the geometric family are very nice so far. Uh, we were on target with our uh, refractive uh, outcomes and also the patients were very satisfied. I can say that even with the uh, glare and halos and the satisfaction of the patients are on par with the other trifocal eye wells. In terms of the refractive outcome with the Vivinex geometric, there was no patients where we had to do any touch-up or any further correction. Um, all those patients are mainly independent of glasses for distance, intermediate and near. And I have also implanted that lens in employees that work here in the clinic that are very satisfied with the outcome. What is a benefit about this lens is that you only have the central diffractive ring, so the periphery is monofocal, which uh, at least from a feeling wise, I feel more comfortable giving it to patients that already complain a little bit about this photopsias. Yeah, patients were indeed very satisfied with the results um, of surgery and with the results of the geometric IOL. Um, patients wanted to get this lens because they wanted to become spectacle independent and this IOL certainly provided very good visual acuity results in the far, intermediate and near distance. So patients were um, satisfied after surgery because they did not require glasses anymore. Having experience with the Vivinex, the monofocal as third version, I know that there is extremely good stability of that platform in the eye. So when you put the lens in the right axis, it will stay there uh, in, in every case. So when correcting presbyopia, astigmatism and myopia or hyperopia with your multifocal toric eye wells, it's extremely important to hit your refractive target and also correct the astigmatism even within a quarter of a diopter of astigmatism to have the, the best results. Yeah, what I really think is um, superior in this uh, lens platform is uh, the IOL delivery device. Uh, my staff knows this device from the monofocal uh, lens that we use as one of the standard lenses in our uh, setup. And I would really say that the multi cert injector is one of the easiest and most convenient injectors, not only for the surgeon to use, but also for the staff to use. 
Well, I think the true benefit about the whole Vivinex family really is the multi-third injector because you can choose between a push injector or a screw injector and it's really what the surgeon feels comfortable with when they're using the lens. The preloaded multi-third injection system is very user-friendly, both for the nurse and for myself, the surgeon. Actually, my nurse tells me that the preloaded system is the easiest uh, to use among those uh, that we are, have been using or we are still using now. From my point of view, I love the smoothing of the injection of the eye well. The inserted shield on the cartridge allows different approaches for controlling the insertion depth. It's a hydrophobic material, they have no glistenings, um, they are far from any opacifications, so you have a really stable C-loop lens that also in a toric version stays on axis and sticks in the capsule. Um, because of the material, also PCO comes slightly later than in other models, so it's a, it's a really like well-approved lens and it really gives you benefits during your surgical routine. There's less work for the nurses, there's less the nurses can do wrong. It's easy to implant and you have very good refractive and visual acuity outcomes. The Vivinex uh, Geometric and the multi cert injector are a perfect combination. The produ product combines an, an excellent optics with an excellent uh, material and an excellent IOL delivery device.